uphold in your church. Father, we thank you, Lord, because the power of hell has not prevailed against your church. Lord, we lift you high, we bless your name. You are worthy to be praised. All glory, honor, and adoration belong to you. For in Jesus' name we've prayed. We're going to pray according to this psalm. We're going to say, lift up your head. All you get that is against the church of God. We say, lift up your head in the name of Jesus. Every evil gate that has been set against your church, every evil gate that has been raised up against your church. We decree according to the word of the Lord today. We say lift up your head in the name of Jesus. Lift up your head in the name of Jesus. Every gate that has been set against your church in the north, in the south, in the east, in the west, oh, in the heavens, in the earth, we decree today. Lift up your head in the name of Jesus. We decree today. Lift up your head in the name of Jesus. Every gate that has been set against the success of your church, against the propagation of peace, against the propagation of the word of the Lord. We come against you today. In the name of Jesus, we pull you down. In the name of Jesus, we pull you down. Every gate has been set against your church. Every stronghold that has been built against your church, we pull you down this morning. In the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we've prayed. Can we all um, face this side and raise up our hands and say every gate. Let's turn to this side. Face this side, please. Every gate that has been raised up against your church on this side. Father, we come against it today. In the name of Jesus, we pull them down. In the name of Jesus, every gate that has been set against your church, every gate that has been set against the word of the Lord in this land, in every nation of the world. Father, we pull them down today. We say lift up your head, all ye gates and be ye lifted up, ye everlasting doors, in the name of Jesus, the word of the Lord has said, I will break the gates of bronze, and cut in pieces the bars of iron, every bars of iron, every gate of bronze, that is all your church captive, that is preventing us to fulfill the mandate you have given unto us, we come against them today, in the name of Jesus, in Jesus' name we pray, let's turn to our right, this side, every gate has been built against the church of the Lord, from this side, we come against them today, we pull them down, by the blood of Jesus, we pull them down, we break in pieces, the bars of iron, we break in pieces, every bars of iron, every gate of bronze, that has been raised up against the success of your church against the peace of your church we come against them today in jesus name we pray let's move to this side and say we decree father every gate has been built against your church we come against them today in the name of jesus father we bring down lord every gate that has been built against your church we come against them today in the name of jesus we come Come against them today. We say lift up your head. Oh, ye gate. In Jesus' name we've prayed. All right, let's face this side. Every gate that has been built up, that has been set up against your church. Father, in the name of Jesus, we come against them today. We pull them down by the mercy of the Lord. We pull them down by the mercy of the Lord. We pull them down by the mercy of the Lord. In Jesus' name we've prayed. The Bible says when Daniel prayed, God already answered. But the prince of Pasha prevented the answer from coming. He closed his heaven. We're going to raise our hands up and say, Father, every closed heaven upon your we open right now. In the name of Jesus, Father, every closed heaven upon your church. Every closed heaven upon your church. Father, we open it right now. In the name of Jesus. Every closed heaven upon your church. We open it right now. In the name of Jesus. Every closed heaven upon your church, Father. We open it right now. In the name of Jesus. We destroy every principalities and power. Every rulers of high places. Every rulers of darkness that has closed our heaven. We destroy them this morning by the name of Jesus. And we decree our heaven is open as a church. Our heaven is open as individuals. Our heaven is open in the name of Jesus. No more closed heaven. No more closed heaven. In Jesus name we've prayed. We're going to point our hands to the floor. One of the Bible passages says, He made the earth to be as iron for them. 
so that even when they are cultivating, it was difficult for them to yield anything. We're going to point to the ground and decree, oh Father, everything that has been done on this earth against your church, we come against it. In the name of Jesus, the Bible says, the earth is the Lord and its fullness thereof. Everything that lives under the earth belongs to you. We come against everything that has been done on the earth, that has been done in the waters against your church. We come against them. We pull them down in the name of Jesus. Every altar that has been erected against your church, we pull them down today. We pull them down today. We pull them down today. In Jesus' name we pray. Isaiah 54, 17 says, No weapon formed against us shall prosper. And every tongue that rises up against us in judgment, you shall what? You shall condemn. We're going to pray, Father. We condemn every tongue that is speaking against your church. We silence every tongue that is speaking against your church right now. In the name of Jesus, Father, we condemn every tongue. We silence every tongue that is speaking against your church right now. In the name of Jesus, Father, we silence every tongue that is speaking against your church by your mercy, Father. Every tongue that is speaking against your church. We silence them right now. In the name of Jesus, we silence them right now. In the name of Jesus, we silence them. Every tongue of condemnation, every tongue of condemnation against your church, Father, we silence them. In the name of Jesus, we silence them by your mercy. In Jesus' name we've prayed. In Jesus' name we've prayed. Get a partner. Let's get a partner. We're going to pray for each other and say, Father, every spirit of coldness, prayerlessness and lukewarmness in your church, we destroy it today. Hold somebody, hold somebody. Every spirit of coldness, prayerlessness and lukewarmness. Oh, Father, we destroy it in the life of this sister, in the life of this brother. Every spirit of lukewarmness, every spirit of coldness, every spirit of prayerlessness, every spirit of not reading the word of the Lord, we pull them down today. We destroy it in the name of Jesus. Every distraction that is preventing us from reading the word of God. Father, we come against it today. By your mercy, we come against it today. Every spirit of lukewarmness, every spirit of coldness, every spirit of prayerlessness, every spirit of immorality that has taken over our life, we come against them today. In the name of Jesus, Father, we come against them. We come against them. By your mercy, we come against them. Every spirit, contrary to your spirit, in our lives, Lord, we come against them. We say it shall not reign. Oh, any spirit contrary to the spirit of the Lord shall not reign in our life. In the name of Jesus, every fruit of the flesh manifesting in our life, Father, we bring it to an end. In the name of Jesus, every fruit of the flesh manifesting in our life, Lord, we bring it to an end. In Jesus' name we pray. Finally, we're going to pray, Father, preserve your people in this world against the work of darkness. Father, preserve all in, in this world against the works of darkness. Father, preserve us, Lord, against the work of darkness. Hey, Father, Jesus said, I have prayed for you that you will be preserved in this world, Father. Preserve all in this world. Preserve us, Lord, against the works of darkness. Preserve us, Lord. Against the wickedness of the high places. In the name of Jesus, Father, preserve us by your mercy. Father, preserve your church by your mercy. Eskele bosh mama ma senke bobo senke magna mama ma senke mama ma senke bobo senke oh lord preserve your people in this world against the works of darkness in the name of jesus father preserve us lord against the works of darkness preserve my home preserve my children preserve my family preserve my mind against the works of darkness thank you jesus for you've done it In Jesus' name we've prayed. We're going to pray. One of the passages we read in our open heavens this week says, there are some people that they have eyes, cannot see. They have ears, they cannot hear. We're going to pray, Father, as I listen word this morning. Give me eyes that see. Give me ears that hears. Give me a mind that perceive in the name of Jesus. Let every veil that is covering my eyes, that is covering my heart be removed in the name of Jesus. 
Every drawers that is covering my ears that will prevent me from seeing the, the, the salvation in your word be removed from my life in the name of Jesus. Father, we receive deliverance in your word this morning. We receive open doors in your word this morning. Father, we receive, Lord, lifted hearts in your word this morning. Our chains are broken this morning in the name of Jesus. Our eyes are open to the wondrous things in your word this morning in the name of Jesus. Oh, every chain is broken in the name of Jesus. We receive our deliverance by your word in the name of Jesus. The word of the Lord brings deliverance. We receive our deliverance by your word. Thank you, Jesus, for you've done it. In Jesus' name we've prayed. Hallelujah. If you know the Lord has answered us, come on, say hallelujah. Hallelujah.